So a land scams are on the rise in North Carolina, prompting a warning from the North Carolina Real Estate Commission. Queen City News anchor Morgan Francis joins us now live in the studio. And Morgan, what's the goal for these scams? Well, Brian, the short answer is cash. So people are posing as fake owners or fake sellers, and they're taking a real estate deal all the way to the closing table sometimes before the other parties in the transaction realize the person never owned the property to begin with. Even if it's just earnest money or a due diligence fee or something. They're looking for cash. The North Carolina Real Estate Commission is warning brokers and buyers to watch out for a growing trend. People posing as owners of properties in order to make a quick buck. Their stories typically entail trying to sell or lease their property from another state or country. You can't see the house. So you're going to have, if you really want it, you know, I've got all these people lined up to lease this house at this great rate. And if you really want it, you're going to need to take it now. Um, and sometimes they get a bite. Janet Thorne with the North Carolina Real Estate Commission says some of them are succeeding. A few of them are getting, have gotten money. Um, and so it's, it's concerning. Renters could end up sending thousands to a person posing as the owner. Home buyers could lose out on their due diligence fee and the house. In one case, two separate real estate agents put for sale signs on a lot only to find out from the rightful owner that the property was never for sale. We've heard about quite a few of these down in the coastal areas, uh, down around the Wilmington area. I think there's it's going on quite a bit down there. I think that everyone needs to be aware of what's happening and on alert. So the scammers are typically asking for a quick close and in cash and usually want to close a deal electronically, which is why they're so difficult to catch. Thorne suggests agents get photo IDs of the client to verify the person is the rightful owner.